Hey folks, today we're just taking a quick look at a really interesting reptile of a sort that I don't see that often, even though they're technically quite common. Uh, this guy is an eastern worm snake, and as you can see, he really does look just like a worm. In fact, I bet I've seen several of these guys in my life and have had no idea that I was looking at a, at a reptile at all. Um, but worm snakes, they live in, like, uh, leaf litter and down in the dirt. Uh, they mostly eat, well, worms, uh, and they're good burrowers, so even though they're quite common, your chances of seeing one aren't especially high. But you'll notice that the snake's eyes are kind of small and vestigial looking. Uh, that's because these guys spend the vast majority of their time in leaf litter or under the ground, so they mostly use senses other than sight to get around and hunt. Uh, but adults of the species grow to about 11 inches long, um, but this individual is even smaller than that. So needless to say, these guys are entirely harmless. Uh, if they weren't, I would not have one in my hand here. Um, but as far as I know, they can't even bite you. Um, the worst they might do to you is smell bad. But even there, there are snakes that smell significantly worse. Actually, uh, ringneck snakes, which are a similar size to these guys and live in a similar environment, actually smell significantly worse. So worm snakes are very harmless. Um, but this was in Elk Neck State Park in Cecil County, Maryland. Uh, I don't know what it is about Elk Neck State Park, but I have actually seen more worm snakes there than anywhere else I have ever been. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and also consider checking out my other channel, From Delaware to India, link in the upper left-hand corner. Uh, there, I explore off-the-beaten-track locations on the Indian subcontinent, such as obscure medieval ruins in the megacity of Delhi, living root bridges in the jungles of Meghalaya, formerly head-hunting Naga villages on the Indo-Myanmar border, and more. Uh, the content there is obviously rather different from what I post here, but you might still find it interesting, and uh, thank you very much.